Hey friends, just a quick Target drive up pickup order. My Target for like the past month and a half has offered like refrigerated items, some, not all, for pickup. Um, and I have not taken advantage of it, but today I just needed a few things and you know, just the way life is, I just wanted to go pick it up. So I ordered two packages of eggs, my favorite, my favorite hot dogs, some butter, two little packages of Brussels sprouts and a little thing of carrots. Hey, hey, keto babes. All right, so quick little haul. You guys, I don't need a lot of stuff. So the only thing I have left to do is I do need to get to the little farmer's market just to get uh, just a few things. But anyway, let me show you what I got here. Um, some bubbly, because I always enjoy bubbly. And then from Target, the coconut pineapple. I bought this a while ago, like almost when I first started my keto journey. And I saw it and I'm like, you know what? I haven't picked it up, let's pick it up. I got some lunch meat at my local grocer. I like to do roll-ups. This is hot capical with some provolone. I love to do roll-ups. Uh, you guys already know Minute Maid. We like to buy them every week. Everybody enjoys them. Um, I try not to drink it too often. Uh, another little option, if your macros are okay with it and you're okay with the ingredients, Fiber One, the cinnamon coffee cake. The cinnamon coffee cake, I can tell you that it is really good. I picked up two of the pints of the keto ice cream, the strawberry. Let me show you the macros here. And here are your ingredients. So they have the bars at Costco. You guys know I'm not crazy about the bars. I prefer Enlightened. Everywhere I go, Enlightened, the bars that are my favorite are sold out. Um, so I have some Rebel in my deep freeze downstairs, but I wanted to try something different. This is the flavor from the bars that they sell at Costco, the sea salt caramel. So I will let you know my thoughts on that. La Terra Fina, I really am loving the chile con queso. Uh, so I picked one up. We picked up two packs of the Mission Balance tortillas. I don't really eat them as often, maybe once every couple of weeks. Um, and I will only eat one. But we picked up two. Some fruit punch, because we had a couple of get-togethers the last couple of weekends, and people were really drinking those. Some pomegranate blueberry. I got some more Melrose peppers. I shared them last week. They're so good. I love them with, like, some Italian sausages. Just some shredded cheese for a couple recipes for the week. And then the last two things. Um, this one I got at TJ Maxx, the fall dessert trio. This one has a pumpkin cinnamon roll, maple donut, and pumpkin caramel scone. Um, $6.99, not bad for these syrups. And then the last thing I did get was this guy. You guys know I'm obsessed with my mini waffle makers. I got the Skull for Halloween. Look how cute. So cute. So I'm excited to use it for the upcoming holidays. You know, my nieces spend the the um, nights here a lot. So I like to make it cute for them. You know what I mean? So that's it guys. I'm telling you, we don't need a lot. My house is stocked, like, except for fresh produce. Hey friends, it's Deborah. Welcome back to the channel. So here is a haul. I'll probably do one more for the week. Um, don't need a lot. I'm gonna be down for about the next two weeks. So some of this is quick grab and go. So let's just hop right into it. Before we do though, please click on that red subscribe button. I would love for you to be part of my journey here. Don't forget to give me a like and then go ahead and share my videos um, to whoever you would think needs some motivation, some tips, some food ideas. So let's go. Um, I did pick up this Alexia cauliflower risotto. I really love that. So I picked one up of those. Some Philadelphia cream cheese. I love the spicy jalapeno. Um, the Teton, the spicy andouille sausage, I really liked it, so I picked up another one. These, La Terra Fina, the Sriracha, three cheese. Oh, so good. I freaking love this. Um, some heavy whipping cream. Enlightened, the dark chocolate bars. These are so good. And yes, look, four. We opened that one already. Four boxes of the Enlightened, 
the caramel dark chocolate peanut. These are my favorite and they've been so hard to find. So we found them and we stocked up. Um, I picked up some blueberries, some raspberries, some sola bread. Um, we got the gold, two golden wheat. And then we did pick up the seeded one, but that's already open. So I didn't want to show you a half eaten loaf of bread. <laughs> I went to Hy-Vee. Um, this was from Meyer. I went to Hy-Vee and I picked up my everything bagels by the Great Low Carb Bread Company. Two bags of the everything bagel. Um, one bag of the pumpkin spice. Two packages of the buns. Uh, Sola bread is life is life i love it um i like their everything bagel with cream cheese from the great little carb bread company and avocado and uh everything but the bagel seasoning so freaking bomb and i haven't had those so i was so excited hi v carries all the solar products all the different flavored granola so i picked up the strawberry vanilla i have not tried that one so i'm super excited this dip this bitchin sauce the buffalo it's my favorite besides the heat which i can never find i freaking love this one i needed some limes so i picked up two limes i also picked up this pack this bag of pork rinds from crave al pastor flavor i would have picked up two but this was the only one that they had zero carbs zero carbs um these were only two for a dollar high v they're pickle ice pops. So I thought I'd give this a try. Don't forget that uh, pickle juice is good for electrolytes. I picked up some spicy pumpkin dry roasted seeds. This is perfect for this time of year. I also picked up this organic sprouted salad topper. This came from uh, Fruitful Yield. It's like a small Whole Foods. I picked up the salad topper. This is the garlic thyme. They had different flavors. Uh, the Lily's baking chips. You guys know how much I love Chalk Zero, but I really wanted to give their butterscotch and salted caramel a try. Um, this is from Walmart. The Zen Sweet. I love Zen Sweet so much. I found this at um, Home Goods, so I picked it up for $4.99. The vanilla bean cake mix. It's so good. Uh, we're here back at Target. This is the second time I'm picking up this pumpkin spice silk unsweetened almond creamer. This is the only one that I can find that has zero carbs and actually tastes like pumpkin spice. It's so good. And then we are back with Perfect Keto Collagen, the salted caramel. I really like this in the fall. I love it. Hey friends, it's Deborah. Welcome back to the channel. So here is a haul. I'll probably do one more for the week. Um... Don't need a lot. I'm going to be down for about the next two weeks. So some of this is quick grab and go. So let's just hop right into it. Um, I did pick up this Alexia cauliflower risotto. I really love that. So I picked one up of those. Some Philadelphia cream cheese. I love the spicy jalapeno. Um, the Teton, the spicy andouille sausage. I really liked it. So I picked up another one. These, La Terra Fina, the Sriracha, three cheese. Oh, so good. I freaking love this. Um, some heavy whipping cream. Enlightened, the dark chocolate bars. These are so good. And yes, look, four. We opened that one already. Four boxes of the Enlightened, the caramel dark chocolate peanut. These are my favorite and they've been so hard to find. So we found them and we stocked up. Um, I picked up some blueberries some raspberries, some sola bread. Um, we got the gold, two golden wheats, and then we did pick up the seeded one, but that's already open, so I didn't wanna show you a half-eaten loaf of bread. <laughs> I went to Hy-Vee, um, this was from Meyer. I went to Hy-Vee, and I picked up my everything bagels by the Great Low Carb Bread Company. Two bags of the everything bagel, um, one bag of the pumpkin spice, two packages of the buns uh sola bread is life is life i love it um i like their everything bagel with cream cheese from the great little carb bread company and avocado and uh everything but the bagel seasoning so freaking bomb and i haven't had those so i was so excited hi v carries all the sola products all the different flavored granola so I picked up the strawberry vanilla. I have not tried that one, so I'm super excited. 
This dip, this bitchin' sauce, the buffalo, it's my favorite. Besides the heat, which I can never find, I freaking love this one. I needed some limes, so I picked up two limes. I also picked up this pack, this bag of pork rinds from Crave, Al Pastor flavor. I would have picked up two, but this was the only one that they had. Zero carbs. Zero carbs. Um, these were only two for a dollar high V. They're pickle ice pops. So I thought I'd give this a try. Don't forget that uh, pickle juice is good for electrolytes. I picked up some spicy pumpkin dry roasted seeds. This is perfect for this time of year. I also picked up this organic sprouted salad topper. This came from uh, Fruitful Yield. It's like a small Whole Foods. I picked up the salad topper. This is the garlic thyme. They had different flavors. Uh, the Lily's baking chips. You guys know how much I love Chalk Zero, but I really wanted to give their butterscotch and salted caramel a try. Um, this is from Walmart. The Zen Sweet. I love Zen Sweet so much. I found this at um, Home Goods, so I picked it up for $4.99. The vanilla bean cake mix. It's so good. Uh, we're here back at Target. This is the second time I'm picking up this pumpkin spice silk unsweetened almond creamer. This is the only one that I can find that has zero carbs and actually tastes like pumpkin spice. It's so good. And then we are back with Perfect Keto Collagen, the salted caramel. I really like this in the fall. I love it. I also picked up two bags of this uh, Southern recipe. The sea salt and black, cracked black pepper is so so good. I love this with that bitchin' sauce, the buffalo, my favorite combination. I picked up a small pack, well, one pack. Um, there's small cans, six cans in a box of the Zevia strawberry lemonade. Really like that. You can find this in the kids section. Hey friends, it's Deborah. Welcome back to the channel. So this week, the grocery is a little different. I um, I'm going in for knee surgery. So I wanted to get some things just to stock up the pantry, things that are easy to make. Um, I guess they're kind of, it's kind of the same because I have been in pain for the past seven, eight months um, with this knee. So let me show you what I got, okay? We're gonna start over here. I did get uh, two things of bubbly and two cases of water. I will not be going to Costco anytime soon. Um, I need to recover, do some physical therapy before I can move around so anyway i have two things uh two cartons of heavy whipping cream but i grabbed another one uh i always pick up some Kerrygold butter i like to get the unsalted i don't get it at costco because i like unsalted i picked up another one of the philadelphia spicy jalapenos um i just stocked up if you watch that haul i just stocked up on some everything bagels from the great low carb bread company i I mean, they're the best ones that I've had so far on keto that I don't make myself. So I got some pepper jack cheese in case, you know, when I'm just lounging, whatever, and want a snack, I got that. My friend Sonia over on Instagram, if you don't follow her, I absolutely love her. She's a, a good friend. Uh, keto Sony, uh, the ghost pepper cheddar, she recommended it. Look at this. Cheddar cheese with jalapeno, uh, habanero, and ghost peppers. She said it was spicy, so I picked up one to give that a try. Um, some corn just for a meal that who's ever making dinner that day can just pop it in the microwave. Um, some Mexican cheese, Velveeta cheese sauce. I always like to have some kind of a cheese sauce on hand in the pantry. I did get some serrano peppers and some jalapenos. Look at this poor box. Um, some people like the cinnamon graham crackers, so I got a box. Hopefully they're okay, I'll check them. Some Ritz crackers. I am gonna be making some soups to prep for while I recover a little bit. I'm gonna make some chicken noodle soup, I absolutely love it, and I'm also gonna make some taco soup. Um, diet cranberry juice, because when you're sick, who doesn't want some juice? I also picked up some ruby red grapefruit juice. I know it's high in carbs, but I'll be recovering. So I'm gonna um, give myself a little break, give myself some grace and do what I didn't need to do. Some soup and oyster crackers, some carrot chips for the chicken noodle soup. Yes, I do eat some carrots every now and then. 
some celery sticks for chicken noodle soup. These, I did buy two more because somebody in my house found them, liked them, and drank them. <laughs> so I bought two more to replace those. Buy drinks, love them. I got the clementine, the pomegranate, and the blueberry. Um, let's see here. This snack pack, snack pack of chips. I always have these on hand for like the neighborhood kids, my nieces, my nephew when they come over. I always have something like this on hand, so I grabbed that. Um, I ordered the chicken tenders and they gave me chicken breast. They substituted it. I'm okay with that. I'm not going to, you know, make a fuss about it. Some turkey. I buy the three packs for Bella. She gets fresh made turkey in her food every morning and every night. So I bought two packs, so she's good to go. This meat, I show it all the time. It's grass-fed, grass-finished. I get it at Walmart, $17.99 for three pounds. I like they're individually wrapped. I just um, cut them up, throw them in the freezer, good to go. I still have a lot of ground beef, but $17.99, you can't go bad. Every time I place a Walmart order, I get one of those. And then I never really get meat at um, Walmart, but I did want to get some thin steaks for tacos, steak tacos. And I def <laughs> I ordered a different kind of steak. I ordered the ribeye, but the choice selects and they, I guess they were out and I ordered thin ones and they ended up giving me two big packs of the regular steaks. So I don't know, we'll see what they taste like. Hopefully they're good. They're just for steak tacos, no big deal. Um, and they, I think they only charge me for one. I have to double check that receipt. Bella, if you don't follow me, she gets a new toy every day. Yes, a new toy every day. And lately I've been buying the Bark ones from Target and they're anywhere from 10 to like $15. And I'm like, all right, let's go to Walmart and pick up a couple. Oh, and I have been buying some from TJ Maxx. They're like $3.99, $4.99. Um, these are like $3.99, $7.99 and what else what else did I get I think that's it oh I got some household stuff um but this bill was 227 but like I said I got a couple of things for the house and um that's it I don't know if there will be another one because I'll be I'll be resting my friends so some me good vibes prayers everything um you'll see this a week after my surgery so hopefully uh i'm feeling well by then so thanks guys thanks for watching